What's up YouTube? Thank you for watching this video brought to you by anthonymarchese.us. Today I'm going to show you how to create rollover buttons in Fireworks CS6. Fireworks CS6 is a web design program and it's excellent for creating rollover buttons. Super easy. Right now we are in the preview mode so I can hover over these buttons and you can see how nice it is. So let's get started. Let's close this. Let's go to new document. And this is our canvas, and we're going to go to the vector tools and click on the rectangle tool. We're going to draw out a rectangle, and let's give it a style. Okay, so now we have our style on this graphic. We're going to convert this graphic first into a button symbol. So let's go ahead and hit F8 on the keyboard. It brings up the convert to symbol dialog box, and I'm going to call this blue button symbol 2. I think I have one in there already. And select button. And we're going to save that to the common library. And we're going to click OK. And then save. We're going to turn off the hotspot. Right now we need to get into edit mode. And the way you do that is you double click the symbol. Now if you look in the properties inspector you can see that we have the canvas properties and the state properties. Right now we are in the upstate. The way this looks, this is how it's going to look in the upstate. Let's go and select overstate. Now we have to copy the graphic. Okay, so let's copy the graphic. It's the same graphic as in the upstate, but now we're going to make some changes to this. We're going to select the graphic. We're going to come down to the gradient tool and we're going to flip it. We're going to click away on the canvas. I'm going to go down to the drop down menu by state and I'm going to select down. I'm going to copy the graphic over again. I'm going to make another change to this button and I'm going to select here. Actually let's do something different. Let's go and we'll put a basic hard line around it and we'll give it we'll give it a couple more. Doesn't really matter. A five pixel width border around this graphic around this button symbol and that's going to be the down state. So now Let's see how it looks. Let's go back to the main area and let's preview this. Yeah. Okay, now let's click it. There we go. There's the border. All right, pretty cool. Well, that's how you create a button rollover effect in Fireworks CS6. If you have any questions or comments, please post them below. Thank you for watching this video.